into every one of these shocks and to kind of you know fuel tanks the, the entire assembly. So the whole thing ends up being you know this kind of complicated model. And again, it is physically driven. Um, so let's do a single sort of run through of this thing, um, kind of in automatic mode. So um, this um, the smoke that Mark was talking about. Look, notice that it actually has a fluid. It sort of billows down the track. And as you travel and you apply more thrust to it, it sort of raises up on its skids. The shock falls apart. And we'll, you know, <laughs> examine all those elements later. I don't think I'm going to clear this one. And they did. Um, oh. uh, okay. You need a little sound there. Oh, yes, I do. Yeah. Yeah. Automatic refers only to the camera. Nothing else. All right, so let's see. Right. You have these boosters on the top. Oops. Okay, all right. Okay, it really it does, is physics. It, right, it does fall apart, doesn't it? Um, all right, I'll be a little bit more careful. I'm going to try to make it all the way down the track now. Um, so this, you kind of have to be very light and gentle on the controls. If you overdo it, you know, bad things happen. Um, right, can we make it now? So we're approaching the bridge. Uh, you'll see some of the destruction debris on the bridge. Some of that facial expression again. We'll, we'll come back to see all these elements uh, in a little bit. And there is the end of the track. And unfortunately, there is no parachute. <laughs> Let's, um, let's see, so uh, one of the things Mark was talking about was facial expressions. Well, let's just sort of zoom in on his face. Um, so it kind of comes out of the screen very nicely if you kind of get really up close. And um, start going down the track and see how his, how his facial expression changes with speed. Going a little bit faster. See that sort of wrinkling and, uh, and distortion <laughs> on his face. Yeah, kind of what we're dealing with, the kind of speeds, get a little bit of, uh, you know, again, I really like this view because it kind of gives you the, the perspective of all the pipes and zooming that's on the sled, and then this just apply all the boosters. So again, we have, uh, we have some of these sort of rocket boosters, and one of the fun ones I like to do is fire the reverse thruster that will uh, just sort of take the whole thing back into a wall and blow it up. Um, you know, our guy, uh, once we focus on him here, we can eject him, and that sort of gives you a very nice view of the vista. Gives you kind of the idea of the complexity in the, in the environment and the sort of draw distances that we're pulling here. I mean, this entire thing is, you know, not cold at all. There's, you know, the airplane goes beyond the sort of the, the furthest object. And <laughs> <laughs> he knows what's right. happening. Oh. 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 All right, let's get started. Um, let's see, so uh, we were talking about the shack, so let's go to the shack and sort of see what that looks like in, um, in stereo. So one of the cool elements that I like to do is just sort of get behind it here, and as the sled approaches from, uh, from behind it, we'll get a lot of this debris and distraction sort of flying in our direction. There we go. You know, just you stopped it. <laughs> I did, but it's just a very kind of, I like the sort of the depth and, and, and perspective that this gives you. Um, and let's, uh, Let's get a little bit closer, maybe, and let's restart it and get the sled going again. Okay, a lot of time playing around with it. I, well, <laughs> I, it comes with, comes with making it, I suppose. <laughs> um, so, that's the, so that's the shack. Um, let's go back to the bridge that Mark was talking about. So here's our bridge, and we can sort of just blow it up. And This is, um, uh, I think in this current time, it's running uh, 10,000 objects or something like that for, uh, um, for, for the debris. We blow it up, and you know there is some of these larger objects are all CPU, and that kind of little stuff is all GPU. So let me go into the mega secret, uber important mode here, and adjust some sliders. Um, so this is yeah, so it's 10k right now. So let's crank that number to let's say 200 something thousand. Um, let's uh, go back to this mode. Oops, need to look away here. Let's reset it. And that's quarter million. And <laughs> Which you know, it's ridiculous. Right I'll be the first one to admit that none of this, you know, makes any physical sense whatsoever, but it is entertaining. I mean and you, you know, you can see again how this, you know just get a little bit closer to this, right? I mean this is you know, this is debris. These are actual particles. I mean, these are actual sort of, you know, boxes. And then you go down and it sort of cascades down and forms all the way down in the canyon. Also, let's see what that looks like with, you know, a half a million. Thereabouts. Let's uh, reset this guy. That's a half a million particles. 
And if you look sort of uh, a little bit further down, kind of on that far wall back there, it almost looks like a waterfall um, is falling down. I mean, it almost becomes a fluid simulation at that point.